So continuing with Sheba's uh, uh, Sheba's training, as you see, there's an excited dog here, an excited dog there. Sheba's nice and relaxed. I can throw a frisbee. Sheba don't get up. The handle is relaxed, uh, regardless of the distractions. Uh, I can put a squirrel down on the ground. She's laying down. There's no energy. I can come over and knock on the door. Notice that the handler is not reacting at all. The dog's behavior. The other dogs are, and they have to learn their lessons. When company comes over and you're worried about it, I'm going to just open this crate and what's going to happen? Look, go ahead. Sheba, go play. Go play. Go play. She stays there. No matter what happens, I answer the door. Sheba is not bothering anyone. We want to release her. Go ahead. Okay, Sheba. Good girl. She gets low. Release your collar always on. So this is great training. I'm going to show you a little bit more. Yes, we Come. So the dog stays on her left, she's relaxed. I can throw this toy, she doesn't get up. Uh, anyway, all right, we'll just continue. We're gonna put a nice video. The point is it doesn't have to be me, it doesn't have to be a big creepy person. It can be a nice young lady with no tension. Dog's mouth is open, she's been in play groups, she's balanced. The only thing that can screw this up is the humans. So this is it, no magic, balanced energy from humans and animals. We ring doorbells, we have toys, we have all kinds of things. The only people, unfortunately, are the humans at home. If you're dramatic, the dog's gonna be dramatic. If you're tense running around and screaming, the dog is gonna be tense running around and barking. Thank you. Okay, we're finishing up Sheba's training. We're gonna review the top 10 things. Leash and collar is always on. Dog is always under my supervision. I'm relaxed. There's no tension. I reach with my right. Open the door. Whoop. The dog doesn't get up. I ask Sheba to lay down. I raise my right hand. Down. She lays down. It's no energy. No drama at the door. No drama. No holding the dog back. We're going to go outside. Give her free time to run around. Okay, finishing up. I'm relaxed. When we're moving forward, the dog always has to be on our left. He can never be pulling. There's two states of mind, our time and the dog's time. So Sheba's on her own time most of the time. But when we need her to be attentive, she has to be. We love her. We remember she only has one eye. So people shouldn't be going up to Sheba. Strangers should respect the fact that she's disabled and not just come running up to her. Children and adult, nobody. We love, I step out my left. Sheba walks, I stop, Sheba sits, <laughs> I step out my right foot, I open the gate, and we're going to go play. Good girl, come on. You can cut. Girl. All right, we're finishing up our training. Here's Sheba. The dog is always in one of two places. This is our top ten list that you follow. So that, she's either out and about under our supervision which she is good girl Sheba she's happy we're interacting I love her but I, she I, she doesn't trigger the love two if she is out under your supervision the leash and collar that we give you nothing else stays on the dog notice I have all her needs are met there's water there's uh, toys the dog when I ask her to go into her crate she has to go place go on go place Good girl. She has to go in there, and that is the only time she gets food. And then she can't come out. Obviously, I'm going out for the day. I close the crate. Obviously, you would have a bed in there, and probably a bigger crate. When I want her to come out, I release her by saying, okay, girl, and she comes out. I want her to play. This is analogous to your kitty cat. That's a kitty cat, and I'm gonna demonstrate in a minute. Good girl, Sheba. Uh, the only place she gets food or treats is in her crate, period. No other thing. The dog must re be released before she comes out of her crate. When you're holding the leash, there's no tension. No yelling or getting angry. This is not about being abusive or heavy-handed. When I want Sheba, I just say, Sheba, come. Good girl. Come, come. Good girl, baby. 
Good girl. I step on the leash. Good girl. I ask you to drop the cat. Leave it. Uh -uh. Leave it. Correct. Here's the correction. Leave it. Good. Uh -uh. So here it is. She can play with the cat, but she can't chase the cat. So we control what she does. We have to teach her the behavior. Good girl. Okay, girl. Good girl. Then she plays. So this is elementary school. We love good behavior. This is love. No food for these things. Good girl. Keep, because of her disability and her sensitivity, keep people away from her that are strangers to her. The electrician, children. Children are the number one victim to dog bite because they're at her level. If they come up to her, there's a good chance she'll nip at them. The electrician, who you may know, when he has a hat on and a pipe and belts and tools, he's no longer the same person. Those dogs don't see so good. So they kind of see images, black and white images. They use their nose to smell. So who, it's very important that she is in her crate when these things aren't taking place. Period, it's simple. She likes her crate. When she cries in the crate, you can't go running over to her. It's analogous to a baby in a, uh, in a crib. Good girl. Uh, so that's it. She's done. She's been bathed. She's been very good. Remember, this is a journey. This isn't done by any stretch of the imagination. We jump-started her. She knows these behaviors. It's imperative that you reinforce these things. If you don't follow these 10 simple com rules, you, you, the training is going to regress back to where it was. It's about low energy, not about a lot of human thinking. Just relax. Look at how nice. Good girl. She be... Sheba, Sheba girl, there's my girl. Yaya, yeah, yeah. Yaya, yeah, Yaya. Yeah. There's my girl, step on the leash. She's here, uh -uh. good, here's my girl. Love, 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 tails up, wagging, happy, no problem, Sheba's a good girl. She needs leadership. Good girl, Sheba, yeah, go get it. Go fetch, 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 watch, here. Oh, go fetch it, go fetch it, yeah. Go fetch it. This is how we interact with dogs. Low stress, no drama. Go out the door, don't let her near the door. I open the door. I don't have to worry about her running out the door. I don't care if she sits, she just can't go out the door. No matter what's on the other side, including your cat. The end of her trip. That's it. Yeah, baby. Good work. Stay. Okay, good girl. Okay, good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Leave it. Uh -uh. Good. This is advanced training. This is high school. Relax. Stay. Relax. He goes the cat. She don't move. Let her go. Okay, girl. Good. Okay. 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 Good girl. Good girl. She doesn't get it. This is high school. Right after elementary school graduation. Good girl. Good girl. Go fetch. No heavy handedness. No yelling or screaming. No talking, really. She's got it. Good girl, babe. Good. Sit. Good. <laughs> Stay. <laughs> Stay. <laughs> Good. No. <laughs> Good. 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 Good